According to the United Nations Refugee Agency, the Lake Chad River Basin region is grappling with humanitarian emergencies. Over 2.7 million people have been displaced, including over 1.9 million from the northeastern Nigeria, with Cameroon and Chad having their share of the figures. This worrying trend has brought about the need for robust conversation on social investments and humanitarian aid. At this meeting, the focus was on the need for the private sector to get involved and complement government's efforts. I am also aware that some private sector organizations have made laudable humanitarian interventions to help address the current situation. I must seize this opportunity to appreciate them. But generally, I believe that the Nigerian private sector could do much more. Bring the humanitarian world closer to the corporate world. Indeed, these two worlds have a lot to offer each other and the humanity at large working together. The Vice President, Silverbird Group, speaking for the Broadcasting Organization of Nigeria, says the media will be involved in the partnership for efficiency. It would be great for Bonn, which is the umbrella of um, all broadcast stations in the country, which is federal, state, and privately owned radio and TV stations, to partner with I ICRC in promoting the good cause. Tony Illuminati Foundation, for example, can empower a lot of people. Without the broadcaster spread the word, it would not have the same effect as it would on its own. We are ready to work with government as auxiliary to public authorities to carry out this assessment and give the strength of the population. The resolution remains that there is a need for the business community to scale up commitments to social investments and increase funding for sustainable solutions. David Babadike, STV News.